Hey everybody, it's Sierra. I'm here today with two reviews. My first review will be for Bravissima, and my second review will be for Mimi Box. I ordered two bras from Bravissimo on the 24th of November, and it's December 1st. And I ordered my Mimi Box back in October, but it said it was shipping in November, and I just got it today as well. This is also the first. So, uh, first things first, let's get started on Bravissimo. I already have one bra that I got that actually fits. It is a plunge bra. It is from Freya. I got it from Nordstrom's. Nordstrom's is a really great place to go if you're on the busty side. A lot of people are wearing the wrong bras nowadays and people need to realize that you're actually hurting yourself not helping yourself so I got it my probably single package Ugh. Get it. <laughs> in this big ass box this cardboard box for two bras but I got that and here they are. I have them right here. Um, it wasn't too bad for the price of it. One bra was about. $30. Another one was $40. But one was on sale. Um, so this is my Curvy Kate Flaunt bra, which was the one that was on sale and it runs for 20 pounds which is equal to $31.39 in US dollars oh excuse me and it's cobalt blue it's got a um, like peacock style feathering design and it's product number CK106 for Kirby Kate and it's got the little cute Bravissimo tag and then the Curvy Kate D to J cup to A. And then that bra is a plunge bra while my Deco Flamingo by Freya is a plunge bra which runs for 25.50 pounds and uh, which is equivalent to forty dollars and three cents in US dollars and you can see that there's cute little flamingos on it and then it's got the Freya tag and the Bravissimo tag and on the bra it actually says that it's 32 sterling pounds I didn't even realize that I said it on there Huh? Okay. Sorry, talking to my dad. Um, and for the Curvy Kate, it is 29 sterling pounds. So, that's not too bad. Uh, the Flamingo bra is in a cool print and is product number FY134 and these are from Bravissimo. The shipping itself was about $12.50 and it shipped from the UK to the East Coast. So that's not really that bad at all. Um, I actually really like that brand. They sell their own bras herself but I wanted to start off with some bras and then see how that was going to go. And see whether or not if it was just a certain brand I liked or a certain style of bra that I liked. I haven't worn them yet since I just got them today, clearly. But I'm really excited and yay Ross! Overall, I really like that brand for Bravissimo or the company. I would buy from them again. I didn't have any problems. I read a bunch of reviews first before I even bought any. I've been getting the pamphlets before I had even bought any bras. So, I mean, I wouldn't mind buying from them again at all.
to be quite honest. And now for the Mimi box. Mimi box came in this cute little envelope, which had this cute little box. I'm turning it the wrong way. Sorry. Came in this cute little box. It's like half the size of my head. <laughs> And then you open it up this way. I already took everything out so it wouldn't fall out. But it's got about six things in it. And this is the special box number 77. My lovely boutique. And all the items that came in are actually full size. It ran about $22, $23. As they all do. But first things first, let's go through the review. Um, the first product is the Sahara Sahara um, Acerola Moist Oil Balm, which is 30 milligrams, and the full size product runs for $17. And this is just the box it came in, which is what I was showing you. And this is the product itself. It's pretty small. Sorry, you can see my computer screen. I'm filming at night. But it, that's that. Here's the ball itself. It doesn't look like anything or anything. It's quite soft. And it smells pretty, pretty good. Um, instructions is to use your fingertip. Apply the balm over dry, sensitive area of the body. This has a bunch of different oils in it. It's Acero Moisture Oil Balm. So it's got macadamia seed oil, horseradish seed, aloe vera leaf extracts, peach extracts, and ear seal extracts, and a bunch more. And then up next, we have the Sahara. The first three products are actually Sahara Sahara, which is pretty cool. But this is the Sahara Sahara Only You Necklace Lip Balm. And then the box is this bling bling. <laughs> and it comes in this cute little box. And the necklace itself is like a silvery gold ish color. I haven't really got to figure out what color it is. I gotta, gotta wait for the sun to come up. But it's more of, yeah, a silvery gold. And it opens like that. Oops. And you can see it. And the ball. Oops. It actually closes by itself. Can't get the whole thing off. For the bomb. Ooh. Um, that's actually quite soft. It like <laughs> melted to the thing, I guess. It's been raining really bad today, and I didn't even know that I had the stuff outside all day. Because I clearly would have brought that in, because I mean, my bras were out there. And I kind of didn't want this to like get soaked because that would suck so much. Brand new bras be ruined. I can't. But this is the balm. You kind of can't see it. The red color and just it's just a plain, clear little balm. And it's nice and smooth. And it smells good. It smells really good. Mmm. So, so that runs for about $34. And that's a full size product. And it's got a lovely coral fragrance, uh, coral radiance, but a peachy scent. And it's called Only You Necklace Lip Balm Number no. One Juicy Peach Tea. Or not tea, it says one each. I can't read. No. And the next product is 
the last Sayer Sayer product that I have, which happens to be a BB cream. This is so cute. I haven't officially opened it yet, but it's a natural shining BB cream from Sahara Sahara. It's full size. It's not open. Now I can't close it. And then there's nothing on the back. It's really, really readable. This is 40 grams. And this runs for about $16. As the full wheel can't speak full retail price and it says it's got micro pearl powders diamond powders and amethyst powders up next is the etude house my castle hand cream which is 30 milligrams and runs for a retail price of seven dollars and you get a random selection of um Ice Frozen, Pink Wish, Sweet Cookie, and Forever Rose, and I ended up with Sweet Cookie, and it has a sweet vanilla scent to it, and it comes in this cute little container, this cute little house, and then you can kind of read which one it is at the bottom, but it's under the uh, product numbers, whatnot. But it's, ooh. I don't know. I never she, it's a twist, <laughs> and that's the little cream itself. It's really soft. It smells really good. This product made the uh, information card paper actually smell really good. Even on the little house, the roof it says E2. It's kind of material. It says E2 house. So cute. And then after that, we have the Too Cool for School Cinema City, which is a CC cream. And it comes in this cute little box with a dinosaur on it. And then if you turn it backwards, there's a car and Look at stuff going on in the video. So cute. And then there's even cute stuff on the back. There's a plane. And on the front is the dinosaur and stuff. But the CC cream is 10 milligrams and runs for $30. Full retail. And it's CC cream and you protect from the sun, takes care of signs of aging, and brightens the complexion. And the last product is the Yoon Jeju Hybon Energy Pack. And these are all three grams. There's four packs. There's two live packs. And one peeling gel and one por gasol pack. And then it says you spread the pack evenly over a clean face, rest for 15 to 20 minutes, and rinse off with warm water. Which is quite nice because I collect the Freemans and I don't know how to pronounce it, Monte Jesu, Jesusu, like face masks. That are only like a dollar or so. You can get them at Ulta. I found a bunch at Walmart. And I found that you can find a lot of the full bottle ones at Ulta. Which is quite nice. Because then you don't have to buy so many of like the little small dollar packs every time. But those are really good for gifts. Keep that in mind. Holiday season is coming right up. But um, let me see. A set of four yogurt-like mask packs, each catered to treat different skin problems and conditions. Two live packs deliver to do energy deep into skin, replenish and cool dry, stimulated face. The pore gasoup pack treats enlarged pores and help rid of excess sebum and dirt clogged up. And the peeling gel exfoliates away dead skin cells for a smoother, well-nourished complexion. 
and those are the six things I got in my Mimi box. This is my first ever Mimi box, and I really like everything that came in it. For about $22, I got a lot more worth than what I had really paid for. So, with that being said, yes, Mimi box are really good. And I like how they're not a monthly subscription. You get it when you want to get it. Which is nice, because it's with monthly subscription, it's like, oh yeah, I want to do this, but I don't have to be committed to it in case I don't like it. You know what I mean? And I like how it's Korean stuff. Because I like Korean stuff. As you can see, I'm slowly but surely making my way and trying to be extra kawaii because it's hard. Well, it's not really hard, but me being my lazy self. I'm not as kawaii as I could be, to be quite honest. But my personality is kawaii. My face is kawaii. I'm kawaii. That's all that matters. So, I just want to thank everybody for watching. And I know this is a really long video. I'm sorry. This is my first ever review video. And I just wanted to do this tonight. I just got everything today. Super excited. Ugh. My hair looks really crazy. Oh well. But anyways, I just want to thank everybody for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. If you want more videos, thumbs up. Hit up the like button. If you want more reviews, I'll do more reviews when I go buy stuff. I'll do haul videos. I'm slowly but surely getting into the game. So, if you want more, let me know. And I'm gonna go now, so stay quiet.